Happy Friday, everyone. Welcome to our weekend vlog. Let's go. Let's go, Mason just said, let's go. The time is here. The boys are home from school, work. Jack said he was excited all day, but his nerves are starting to hit. We have the pregame hoopla going on right now, whatever you want to call it. So that's probably why his nerves are starting to go. It's day one, or game one, I should say, of the World Series. This is crazy, excited, been um, counting down the days all week. So got my lucky shirt on. So perfect timing, Jack got the mail on the way home from work. Mace, do you want to show? Fresh off the press from Philadelphia, Jack's sister just sent these out. Ready for this? Hopefully we can do this. Hopefully they will be greasing the poles once again in Philly. So if you didn't know, in Philly that's something that they like to do. They like to um, climb up the poles when um, they win important games and all the things. So that's what's happening. Um, Jack's got his. He's rocking his already. He's editing. Yeah. <laughs> Mason wore his jersey to school today. Yeah. So we got the pre-stuff on. You guys ready? How we feeling? I'm ready. Let's fast forward a couple hours. Let's get going. Win or lose. Let's just watch this thing. I got the Eagles crock pot. That's going to be dinner. It's barbecued chicken. Easy dinner because we're going to be watching the game tonight. But here we go. Game one, you guys. Who do you have? Let's see. When will this vlog go up? Wednesday. So could we have a winner by then? Yeah. Somebody sweeps. Oh, so we could possibly have a winner. Let's hope not, because I'm like feeling like if somebody's getting swept, it might be the Phillies. So let's, uh, let's hope we're still playing <laughs> We're a little baseball. nervous to play the Astros, not gonna lie. It's gonna be, it's gonna be tough, but here we go. All right, that's it for now. We're gonna continue watching some of the pre-stuff, but let's go Phils. I think we have about, what, Jack? Less than an hour till first pitch? About 40 minutes. 40 minutes. <laughs> Dinner is ready. There's my chicken that's been Cooking all day, it smells good. And then I've got fresh green beans and barbecue baked beans on the stove. Like I said, easy dinner. I'm gonna sit down on the, the couch and hopefully watch the Phillies. Hit, 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 hit. <laughs> That's what we always want Mason's team to do. Hit, hit, hit. That's what we need to do against these really good pitchers that the Astros have. So, who's even pitching? We have Nola, I know, right? Nola versus Verlander. Nola versus Verlander, so. All right, let me whip up these sandwiches, and here we go. Let's go food. Good morning. Good morning, everyone. How's everyone doing? It's Saturday. We're alive. <laughs> Holy moly, what a game last night, you guys. Wow, the Phillies end up taking game one in the World Series in extra innings. I mean, anytime you can get extra innings in the World Series, that's awesome, like good games. But yes, Phillies take game one, which is what we needed. We needed to at least take one while the boys were in Astro, or in Astro, in Houston. So we did it last night, <laughs> barely. But um, so last night, um, yesterday was my dad's birthday. So Mason ended up calling my dad to wish him a happy birthday towards the beginning of the game. They ended up talking on the phone for I think over an hour watching the game together. The cutest thing. Um, just talking about players, situations, and then Papa ended up having to get off the phone because um, he had to eat his birthday cake with Mima. So, and then <clears throat> that's when Jack and Mason, literally the last part of the game, it's like situational, like you can tell Mason loves the game. This is the pitch I would throw. Um, it was amazing. In fact, Jack probably has no voice today. He is trying to roll out of bed right now. Um, thankfully, the dog let us sleep in. It is 7.30 which is sleeping in for us because we were up late last night by the time the extra innings were over and we were just like on a high. We couldn't go to bed. We were just so excited. Um, we watched the post game stuff, all that kind of stuff. But anyways, so then like Jack and Mason were talking about the game and you know, I, I will see what time Mason wakes up. Like I said, Jack's trying to roll out of bed. I'm trying to wake up drinking my coffee. But here's the thing you guys, we get to do it all over again today which is insane. So hopefully we have an exciting game once again, but for right now, I'm gonna drink my coffee, watch the news, take the dog for a walk, make Saturday morning breakfast. Oh, and I don't think I told you, we actually have an off weekend for Mason. So no baseball tournament, you guys. 
we went, I don't know, were you guys keeping track? Five weekends in a row of baseball tournaments. You're playing, I like, know last weekend wasn't really a baseball tournament. He just played a couple college teams. Go back and watch that vlog. But we have an off weekend and it came at the perfect time so we can just watch the Phillies this weekend. And then of course, Sunday is Sunday football. We got the Eagles who are still undefeated. Crazy. So that's what we plan on doing this weekend. It's a much needed break um, from baseball. Sort of, even though we're watching it on TV, but yeah, what a night. Go Phils, you guys. I need to wake up, I'm, I'm gonna drink my coffee. Okay, I think we're slowly starting to recover from last night, just so we can go again tonight, but we're, uh, Jack and I, Mason has not got dressed for the day. In fact, he still needs to do chores for the day, but we're getting ready for tonight. Side note, since I've been cooking a lot at home, we have lots of leftovers. Um, at one point this weekend, it's gonna be like a leftover dinner night. Eat this, 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 clear out the fridge because lots of leftovers. In fact, right now it's lunchtime. I'm heating up some turkey meat that I had from last week. I think I'm just gonna chop up some lettuce, tomato, I grated some cheese, sour cream, salsa, tortillas if you want a tortilla with it. Just kind of make a little Mexican style salad, I guess. Dinner is going to be ready right before the Phillies game tonight. Same thing as we did last night. And yes, I'm using the Eagles crock pot because that's a good luck charm right there. It's a roast, by the way. Carrots and potatoes. So that'll be yummy. Um... Yeah, so that's what we're doing. And then I think before the Philly start, I'm gonna run off to Target because I haven't had a Target run. I just kinda wanna get out of the house to calm the nerves, do a little retail shopping. Actually, I, I kinda wanna check out like their bullseye. I know like a lot of the Christmas stuff is starting to come out even though we haven't even had Halloween yet. It's on Monday, it's close enough. I wanna get to the Christmas stuff before everybody takes it. I have heard that there's a like a countdown advent type calendar of the little um, birds that you guys, I have my Halloween ones out right now. Whatever this brand is, but there's like an advent calendar. Oh, I don't think I showed this. Mason decided to add to my um, Halloween decorations. This was Jack's um, World Series championship hat back in 2008, the last time they won. But Mason um, found that stuff upstairs and brought it downstairs to um, add to my decorations there. I love it. It'll stay there until the World Series is over. Okay, yeah, so let me chop up this lettuce, get some lunch in the bellies, and then a little Target, and then it'll be game time. <sighs> Breathe, everyone. <laughs> Breathe. All right, I just scored in the bullseye. Got some Christmas stuff before it's all gone. This is gonna be for Ace's treats. <laughs> yes. We were thinking this, but that's probably not gonna be big enough. What are you trying to say? Not for our dog. He needs lots of treats. All right, you guys. I feel like deja vu. We're about, what, Jack? 40 minutes till first pitch for game two. Dinner is ready. There is a roast down there. About ready to get that going. This is the best bread ever to dip. Yes. But our random little um, Target haul. I got this little riser. Jack found these, had to get them, because it's it's a little pack of three. It's our family. These were cute. Like we said, for Ace's treats. I originally had that one, but we went with the bigger one, so I don't know. Do I return this? I know everybody wants these right now. I finally found one. <laughs> um, for a car, I got, look at these cute little earrings. What were they, three bucks? And then I needed some hair stuff, and that's pretty much it for a little Target haul. Mason's downstairs now. <laughs> are you, what are you doing? I like the shirt. We're talking about the fighting right there, fighting fills. But this is their, um, is it their double A? Is that what that is? Yeah. Double A, double A right there. All right, I like it, I like it. Are you ready? You ready for dinner? I know it's for dinner. It's right there. Do you smell it? I don't know what's for dinner. So it's it's a roast with potatoes and carrots and some yummy bread. Jack? Yep. How is Jack? We haven't seen Jack all day. He barely has a voice. We did a lot of screaming yesterday. A lot of screaming. And his voice is a little hoarse. Yeah. 
<laughs> I saw somebody else say, I don't, my throat is killing me from screaming. I was like, oh yeah, that's Jack today. I understand, yeah. Yeah, that's Jack. Emotional game. <laughs> it was a very emotional game. Um, our neighbors probably think we're crazy because we were literally screaming at the top of our lungs. But we kept the window shut last night, so hopefully. But um, another thing for, um, this is just funny. So yesterday I had Ace in this Halloween bandana and Mason quickly ripped it off of him because it's astral colors, they wear orange. And um, he said, that's why we're losing. And as soon as he switched, where's his bandana? Oh, it's upstairs. We, took a, we always take it off at night when he sleeps. Um, we put a different one on and then all of a sudden, the Phillies started winning. But another thing he did was he literally got out every single one of Ace's like red, well Ace has kind of mixed them in throughout the day, but all of his red toys. <laughs> and just like that, they started winning. So I'm a little disappointed, you guys. I did order Ace a bandana, a Phillies bandana from Amazon when they clinched to go into the um, World Series and it's not here yet. And at this point, I don't think it's going to arrive. Um, I've done this a few times with Amazon and when I get that, oh, your package is running late, it should be here by this date, but if not, come back and get a full refund. I think I'm gonna probably be getting a refund, but it was just a little bandana with the P on it. I was excited for him to wear it all week, but um, I don't know, maybe it'll show up. Well, tomorrow, Sunday, the mail won't come. We'll see, maybe Monday. But all right, let's get some dinner in the belly. Sit down. Let's go Phil. I almost forgot. We got a toy for Ace for Halloween. Wanna give it to him? Isn't it cute? <laughs> Ace. We also got him Prime. His list was Prime, some Halloween cereal that he's gotten like every, what is it, Frankenberry? Frankenberry and iced tea. So we got all the things. Oh, yeah, we're ready. Oh, good boy. Do you love it? Bye, have fun. Add it to your toys. There you go, good boy. Good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday. Definitely not waking up the same that we did yesterday. It's okay, there's a lot of baseball left. A lot of baseball, and like Jack said, at least we took one game in Houston, so that's always a good thing. But there's lots of baseball left. How you feeling? Would have been better 2-0, but uh, <laughs> but you're okay. We'll take the split. All going right. back to Philly now. Yeah, now we go back to Philly. Yeah, I've never seen anything Did like that. Did we play in playoffs, yeah. two in Philly or three in Philly? Three. Three in Philly. So let's just knock it out. Win one, two, three in Philly, and this then be done with it. Three go from there. <laughs> Win that one. But today we can breathe. We're taking a little break from baseball. Um, it's I guess their travel day. Are they traveling back to Philly today, yeah. or did they go last night? I I they may have gone home. They might have gone last night. I'm sure, Houston just... stayed in Houston and they're leaving today. Okay. Philly's probably got today's out. Today's a travel day, so we get to not watch baseball, but we get to watch. Do, 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 do. There you go. The undefeated. Eagles, so they play at 10 a.m. I think the Cardinals also play at 10 a.m. So we'll have to switch back and forth or watch the red zone, which the boys tend to do on Sundays because of their fantasy football. Everybody's lineup's good. I think I've checked mine a couple times. I should be good. Got up, walk the dog. Well, Jack walked the dog. I made breakfast. Mason's over there. How was it? Finishing breakfast. <laughs> he just ate his oh, breakfast. Oh, not hot enough. Yeah, we just plan on watching football all day. I think eventually we're going to carve the good old pumpkin there. I got my jack-o'-lantern shirt on. And just take it easy. It's definitely gonna be a leftover day. I did make breakfast today, but it's gonna be eat whatever is in the house type of day. <laughs> you guys okay? Yeah, no. You guys are crazy. All right, and Ace. Ace can wear his orange bandana today. What did I do? <laughs> because the Astros do not play the Phillies, so he's allowed to wear orange, and so am I. So that's why I wore my orange today. Flyers not, orange. not tomorrow. Tomorrow we'll have to be back in Phillies red. Flyers orange, yeah, they do wear. Like my man Grady, both the fruit. All right, I guess that's it for now. Go Eagles and go Cardinals. The Eagles final. They are seven and zero. Oh. They just won. Cardinals are trying to win, but they're also trying to lose this game. So what's the score? They're down eight right now. It's almost over. They're down eight, so not looking good. But you, <laughs> this is the other situation we have going on. This is lunch. 
I made a salad. I did make guacamole this morning that was chilling in the fridge. Mason had nachos with the guacamole with our fun fall chips. Jack had a little bit of chips and salsa over there. He loves this salsa, by the way. That's good stuff, according to Jack. And then he has something. What do you have going on in there? Hot dogs in the, I don't know what they call Hot dogs in a blanket? In the freezer? Beanie weenies? What the heck do you call them? I don't know. Pigs in the blanket? Pigs in the blanket. That's Pigs what you call them. <laughs> Beanie weenies? There's, I don't know what that there's is. no beans in the air fryer, but that is very true. hot dogs wrapped in like a pastry thing that was in the <laughs> freezer. So that's going to be lunch. And like I said, dinner is literally going to be whatever you see in the fridge. You grab it, you eat it. We have leftover chicken, barbecue chicken. We have leftover pot roast from last night. Plenty of food in the house. Mason is finally showering, getting ready for the day, but he sat and watched the morning games with us. So that that's lunch. Do you love it? Ace does. Ace does He's yeah. like, wait a minute, anything for me up in that table? I did give him some um, cucumbers. He ate some cucumbers and some cheese off my salad, so he's spoiled. Time has come to carve our pumpkin. So Mason and I were just watching the afternoon games are in the fourth quarter, so football's almost over besides the Sunday night game. But we were looking through, we always cheat and get these things because we're not very creative. And we're going through it and we're like, oh, which one should we do? And I'm like, ooh, probably not that one. That one's challenging. We'll skip that one. And then we came to this one, like, hello. How can we not do that one? And it's pretty easy too, so I think we can handle that one. What do you think, Dad? I think so. Yeah? So if you guys don't know, Arizona Cardinal, Cardinals um, quarterback is Kyler Murray. That's Murray. Even though the Cardinals lost today, they tried in the end, like I said earlier, they were trying to win the game, they were also trying to lose the game, well, they lost the game. Um, but that's okay, Kyler is on my fantasy football team and he got me quite a few points because he always does in like the last quarter the first quarter i think i had like two or three points i was complaining to the boys and then all of a sudden i look at my score and bam <laughs> so i'm looking good mason also has kyler on one of his teams because he has like four teams i'm pretty sure he's on like one of your teams mace or two it's on zero oh you don't have kyler murray oh just I Oh, I you, my you do. I knew somebody was always rooting for Kyler with me. But anyways, all right. So, Mason's favorite part of carving pumpkins, you guys, is getting the guts out. No? No. You don't want to get the guts out? No. He says no. So I said, all right, I'll get the guts out. And then I saw on TikTok, or actually, I think I was watching the news, and it was a lady doing a, a segment talking about carving pumpkins. You can get the guts out with using one of these. Should we try it? We'll see. Maybe I'll bust this out and see if it'll get all the stuff out and clean it up really good so it's easy, easier to carve. How's football going? Uh, Eagles won. <laughs> Eagles did win. All right, let's 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 dig into this guy. Ace, you gonna help with the pumpkin? Nope. Nope. Okay. <laughs> we'll go bark on top. Pumpkin's good for dogs. Cool. Almost. <laughs> oh, oh yeah. Perfect. Now scrape it all out. Yeah. Leftovers for dinner. Mason's, Jack's. And then I think I'm gonna heat up the leftovers. Um, I almost said stew. Roast from last night. But the pumpkin is done. Ooh. You probably should light it. It looks so much better when they're lit. Yeah. But there you go. It's gonna look so awesome tomorrow night. I think you guys on that note, we're gonna go ahead and end the vlog. Sorry we didn't go anywhere this weekend, but it was a much needed off weekend for the Bevos. Like I said, we went five weekends in a row playing baseball with that kid. So to sit on the, at one point today, you guys all, one, two, three, how many is it? Four of us, including the dog. Four of us were sleeping on the couch watching football. So, much needed weekend off. Kind of just regroup. Add it again next weekend. So, stay tuned for all of that. Um, don't forget to like this video, comment something in the comment section, subscribe. As always, thanks for watching. We will see you next time.